Sports tonight, the Maine Celtics continued their three game home stretch tonight as they welcome the Delaware Blue Coats to the expo here in Portland. Maine would get a good game from Deontay Burton. He had 11 of his 16 shots made from the field and finished with a team high of 26 points. Luke Cornett with the back in the team after spending some back with the team after spending some time in the NBA. He added 19 points for Maine. But Braxton Key had a game high 30 points and added 13 rebounds to the 111 107 Delaware win. Maine is home again on Saturday afternoon. And Simon scored a game high 22 points to lead the University of Maine women's basketball team to a 77 51 win over rival New Hampshire. The Black Bears made a season high 15 three pointers in the win. It was the 100th win as Maine head coach for Amy Vashon. In high school hoops, Freeport hosted unbeaten Wells. The Falcons sticking around in the first half. Maddie Cormier scores the putback, and Freeport was down three. But then Wells goes on a quick run. Grace Brandel works inside for two. Then Grace Boucher steps outside and drains the three. Well stays unbeaten with the 50 to 40 win. The Graydon Gloucester girls hosting Freiburg Academy. Emma West makes the short baseline jumper to give Gray a seven point lead in the first quarter. And then it's Isabel Ross. She drives to the hoop, makes the basket. She is fouled. She had nine points. Brooke Emery had 10 points for Freiburg, but Great New Gloucester wins that game 44 to 30. On the boys' side, Wayne Fleet hosted unbeaten Yarmouth, and the Clippers would take quick control of that game. Jack McCosh works on the block for two. Peter Ishoish then hits the three. He had 19 points, and Matt Waldner added 15 in the 57 to 25 Yarmouth win. The Clippers are 9-0. The Morse boys missing six players. They hosted Gardner tonight. Gavin Coyne gets the tough drive to go down for the shot handed to shipbuilders. But the other way, Calvin Catchings hits the pull, the pull up their jumper on the baseline for the Tigers. Then catching passes to Ryan Morse inside. Two more. Gardner wins that game 53 to 25.